Hey there, RTD clan. Today, let's talk about John Hussman's take on the U.S. stock market. This guy is doubling down on his predictions, even though the market surprised everyone with impressive gains this past year. So according to Hussman, the stock market is in a bit of a pickle. He's an expert on asset bubbles and has correctly predicted market downturns in 2000 and 2008. Now he says that stretched equity valuations suggest the S&P 500 index would have to drop by a whopping 64% to find some type of balance again. He's not shy about it either. In a recent article, he called the current situation a bubble and he's pretty sure it's going to end in tears. And that doesn't sound good to say the least. Now, despite widespread predictions of a recession due to the Federal Reserve's interest rate increases, U.S. stocks have been doing great, especially tech stocks. Companies like NVIDIA, Apple, and Tesla have been leading the charge with the whole artificial intelligence craze going on right now. But Hussman is not convinced. He believes that the market's price action and overall sentiment are unfavorable right now. Despite the market rebound since October, he thinks this is just the beginning of a much bigger collapse. To put it into simple terms, valuations tell us how expensive stocks are compared to certain measures like company earnings and sales. Right now, valuations are high, which means there's less room for stock prices to go up and returns could be much lower. So brace yourselves, my friends. According to Hussman, we might be in for a rough ride. He's warning that this could be the most extreme speculative bubble in U.S. history. Time will tell if he's right or not, but it's better to be prepared than just in case. Remember, investing always comes with risk. Since the Federal Reserve has decided to forego the typical boom and bust cycle by letting the system flush itself out, all we have left now is Wall Street casinos. As I've been documenting this for the last few years, all the big money players, i.e. billionaires, have already exited the casino tables long ago. They have been taking chips off the table right after the V-shaped recovery from the pandemic stimulus rally that we had a year ago. Now guess who's left holding the bag of what seems like overpriced shares? That's right, the working class and the current retirees, the people who prop up the stock market in their 401ks, IRAs, and pensions. So now we can add John Hussman, another market contrarian, along with Ray Dalio, Stanley Druckenmiller, and others who have all issued warnings about what is inevitable. So now we wait and see whose prediction will come first. It's essential to keep an eye on the markets and make calculated decisions nowadays. You better believe those guys wouldn't be out here sounding the alarm if they didn't plan on profiting from it. They're obviously not getting in the stocks right now. They're betting against the house, the Wall Street casinos, that is. One thing you should take away from this is to not just focus on what they say, but try to predict what they will do to protect their own fortunes and how they will make a killing when the recession becomes obvious to the working class. While well, everyone tries to rush to the exit when they smell smoke, these sharks will be shorting the heck out the markets and laughing all the way to the bank. Just something to think about. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comments section. Thought I would just bring this article to you because I found it to be very informative. Curious to hear what you think. I'll see you guys on the next quick take. Enjoy your day.